DMB Medicine from Gangaram Hospital versus MD Medicine from a tier 2 city like Jaipur, Rohtak or Lucknow. Which one should you choose? Hi, I am Dr. Rahul Chawla, founder of Health Pill Academy and this has been one of the frequently asked questions that I am getting in my DM these days. Theoretically, there is no difference between DNB and MD as I discussed in my last video. However, if you are planning to join as an assistant professor in a government medical college, then you need to know these two important points. First is that many of the DNB institutions do not give you teaching experience that can hamper your chance of becoming an assistant professor. And secondly, there is also an inherent bias against DNB during these kind of selection process. Now, if you are going for private practice, then it doesn't make any difference whether you are going for MD or DNB because it doesn't make any difference to the patient. Now, comparing the academics and work experience, Gangaram Hospital has one of the best DNB programs. In fact, I would say doing DNB medicine from Gangaram is better than doing MD medicine from any of the newly opened medical colleges in tier 3 cities. Now if you compare DNB medicine in Gangaram hospital with MD medicine in good established medical colleges like SNS Jaipur or PJ Rothak or KGMC Lucknow, then traditionally people would go for MD medicine. Talking about DNB in Gangaram hospital, here you will have decent exposure in OPD and IPD but not so much exposure in the emergency. Also, the quantity is way less than what the government hospitals have. But the quality of care and the guideline based treatment that you would be learning in good DNB institutions like Gangaram is something that you can't do in government medical colleges. Now two major pros of choosing Gangaram would be number one that there is no bond. You can easily do three years of DNB and then prepare for your DM examination. You don't have to serve anywhere unlike in other state medical colleges. And the other is the workload here is lesser compared to the government medical colleges and so is the work related harassment and toxicity. So if you want to settle in Delhi, you don't want to go for a place that has a bond and you want a place that doesn't have that much of work related toxicity and harassment, then DNB in Gangaram can definitely be a good option. Rest, it all depends on your own priorities. Take your own decision, considering all these points in mind. If I may have missed any point, then do let me know in the comments.